What is going on everybody? Welcome back. Sorry for the lack of uploads again. Uh, life is crazy. I don't have a lot of uh, free time as of late, but I do today because I finished all my homework early for the week. Yay me. I have reserved this specific day to record some content. <laughs> Gonna be reviewing a new product. Fairly new, but uh, kind of like a reskin, I guess you could say. Um, I got this in the mail yesterday, and we're just going to review it today and look at it and unbox it and see how it looks in person. It is on this table right here looking at me, calling my name to open it, and I can't wait. So today we are going to be taking a look at the, the Juice Blacked Out Collector's Box. This box came out first with one skin. I'll put a picture of it right here. It was just like a, a green, purplish um, design to it. They came out with this box for Halloween, basically. Kind of like a spooky, blacked out version. And I never copped the first Juice Collector's box because it sold out in like 10 seconds almost. I know I did post a review of the Juice. I only got the tub. Uh, I didn't get the full collector's box. And I didn't get a give a high rating on it, but Today we're going to re-explore it and see if uh, my, my understanding and taste of this flavor changes. So we're going to see how it goes. So let's just get right to it. Here's a little look at the collector's box. It's a really, really nice design to it. Like, look at that. That looks amazing. The Gamma Lab logo. You got the G Fuel on top and the bottom, nothing that exciting. Like, look at, it's so beautiful. I freaking love it. Beautiful collection. Be beautiful addition to my collection. There you go. So let's just open it up and see what's in the box. Ooh. 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 Look at this, guys beautiful color it's black but like the the accents on the logos just make it much, much more flushed and then we have the top which is like a pink uh pink and white top and if i'm not mistaken the inside would be pink too yeah the inside divider is pink really nice shaker i like it very very much and of course we got the tub inside and there we go. Look at that. I actually, let me, let me grab the old tub and we'll compare it. So here is the original um, tub of the juice. And then we have the blacked out version. I'll be completely honest with you. The blacked out version is my favorite. It's just more flushed and a really nice color. Let me know in the comments which one you guys like better. Which one looks better to you. Let's just break the seal and then we're going to do a little, a little, uh, Taste test 2.0 with the juice. <laughs> so I actually never broke the seal on camera. So I always break the seal before I record it. But this was a brand new. Oh my God. Yeah, this was a brand new G Fuel shipment that I got. Why is it? Ah. I want a perfect opening. What did he say? Oh. No. Okay. Time to break out the scissors. <laughs> okay. Let's just do that. There we go. That should be good. There. Oh, it's not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. So let's take off the protective seal. Okay. Still has that watermelon smell. So this is 100% a reskin. It is not a redesigned formula of any sort. I just kicked my desk. It is 100% a reskin. So let me go fill up this shaker with water. I'll be right back, guys. We've got our shaker full of water here. And now one of probably my least favorite and most favorite parts of shooting a brand new G Fuel product is to fish for the scoop. It's right on top. 
Oh my god. Do you guys see that? Do you guys see that? It's right on top. Holy crap. That's amazing. When you get the first shaker, when you get the first shaker, when you get the first scoop, I say this in every single one of my videos, you do not want that first scoop in your shaker. For the love of God, do not do that. That's gonna give you a caffeine overload and then you're gonna be bouncing off the walls like crazy. <laughs> um, yeah, don't do that. Please don't do that. So, just gonna take off the funnel and usually twist it and then pull it off. I've got powder all over my pants. So let's open up this shaker. I've got a gazillion things on my desk right now. We'll open this up. Take a scoop, just like show. And then we're just gonna dump it in the shaker. Let me just shake this up really quick, guys. And then we'll be right back. <laughs> let's do a little pop test really quickly. That was so bad. Yep, the watermelon still comes through. Again, I'm not a big fan of the watermelon. That's the thing, but I do like fruit punch, fruit punch flavored things. Let's see if I still give the same rating as I did with the juice. Let's give it a taste. Interesting. That's so weird. Let me break down what I'm thinking right now. Tasting this, I taste more of the fruit punch aspect than I did with the original tub. That's odd. Maybe it's my taste buds screwing with me, but I actually kind of like this. <laughs> what the heck? I'll be completely honest with you. I think I'm going to give it a higher rating. I don't remember <laughs> what I rated the juice. Let me see if I can find that out. So I gave it a six out of 10. I'm gonna give this one a 7.5. Don't ask me why, I really don't know. I don't even know, <laughs> I don't even know how to comprehend that it's the same, it's the same exact thing, but this one tastes better. <laughs> I sound like a freaking crazy person or, <laughs> okay, we'll just, we'll, we'll just end it there. Um, we'll set 7.5 out of 10 for this flavor. Definitely. Um, if you like watermelon punch, any fruit punch, real fruit, watermelon flavored things, you're gonna like this flavor. Um, and if I'm not mistaking, this collector's box is actually still in stock, believe it or not. So if you wanna cop that box, go right ahead, ladies and gents and non-binaries. That's pretty much it for the video today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you guys tuning in and uh, supporting my videos. I really appreciate it. And if you guys like what you see, please make sure to drop a like and drop a comment too. Which one was your favorite reskin? Did you like the blacked out one? Did you like the, the OG, the juice tub? Let me know in the comments. And of course, if you guys like my face, if you guys like my content, and if you guys like what you see, please make sure to smash that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. And keep an eye out on future videos. By doing so, you can hit the bell notification to uh, get some push notifications for whenever I upload something. And that's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Keep drinking the G Fuel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.